Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you are new. My name is Mandy and today I'm sharing with you a small grocery haul. I just shopped the sales this week. Um, I didn't need anything from Walmart. I do need some coffee filters and I was going to run into Dollar Tree to see if they had some, but I just didn't want to. So let me just turn you around and show you everything I got. I'm gonna go over prices with you as well. So if you like this kind of video, please give me a thumbs up and let's get right into it. All right, so really quick, if you're new, we are a family of three, my husband and I and my 15 year old daughter. Um, yeah, I have two older children, but they are moved out. We live in Arizona. So this is Smith's, which is my Kroger store. And originally it was gonna be $162. I had $77 in coupons and a $15 off if you spent $75 or more, which brought my total down to $70.22. It was actually gonna be more than that. I had ordered some Dunkin' Donuts coffee, but it was unavailable. So $70, I'll tell you what right now, I wouldn't have spent 162 for this. <laughs> Anyway, we'll start with the drinks. I did order a Coke Zero Cherry, but they were all out. So the lady that brought out, this was a pickup order, the lady that brought out my groceries, she exchanged, um, she had substituted a Coke Zero, and I asked if I could go in and exchange it for a regular Coke, because these are buy two, get three free. And if, you do, if I would have just not accepted the substitution, I wouldn't have got the deal. So anyway, um, they're $9.99, you had to buy two, got three free. So I got one A&W um, Zero Sugar, and then four just regular Coke. The butter was on sale, thank goodness. It's also on sale at Safeway, and I think I'm gonna get some more, but I got five pounds of butter. They were on sale for $2.79, which we all know it's a good deal right now. Um, string cheese I didn't see on my receipt. I think it was $3.99. It was on sale. It's the only reason I got it. These were still in my cart from the last time I made, um, I like put things in my cart and then I ended up going in the store. <sighs> so I didn't need these. I wouldn't, I wouldn't even have bought them, but they were in there. I wasn't going to have her take them off. So $3.99 for two of these. I think they were on sale last week, maybe for $2.99. And I was like, man, I need to stock up, but I got plenty of creamer for a while. Um, the, all the like fresh sausage like this was on sale for $2.99. So I just got one package of beer brats. The peaches were 99 cents a pound. Um, I took a chance and let them pick them. They seem to be pretty good condition. They're not ripe yet, but they'll be ripe soon. And I've been loving fresh peaches. Uh, these chips I can't find in the store. I don't know where they're hiding them, but <laughs> my pickup person found them, I guess. They are $3.29 um, each. But this is a 16 ounce bag. And compared to the other bags of tortilla chips you get, this is a lot more. It actually takes us quite a while to go through one bag, but we love these lightly seasoned. And then um, these Southwest style are really nice, like thin and crispy. Um, yeah, our favorite tortilla chips. I did get a package of this Donut Shop Blend Coffee. It had a 70 cents off coupon. It made it $3.60, not bad. This is what I prefer when I'm making iced coffee, I'll just brew this and put it in the fridge for the next day. But I had bought some like in a can so I could, oh, there's a hair. I bought some so I could make um, like a pot of coffee and put it in the fridge because Caitlin likes iced coffee sometimes too. But I can't find my coffee filters. I must have got rid of them when we moved. So I need some coffee filters. Um, this Best Foods mayonnaise was on sale for $3.99. I picked up one of those because we're out. I do prefer the squeeze, but um, it was not on sale for $3.99 in the like pouch. All of these snacky things, crackers, were $1.99. I usually like stock up on this stuff right before Thanksgiving when it comes on sale for $1.99. And um, I just thought it was a great deal right now. 
um, yeah, so I don't know, maybe for us, maybe to prepare for the holidays. I know we already have some Ritz crackers, so these will be put away for later. I also got a package of Triscuits and a box of Wheat Thins, and I got one of each of the peanut butter and the cheese Ritz um, bits. These are just delicious and a little something Clayton can put in a lunchbox or something if he wants to, or we can take with us to fair. I did get a package of gum. This is $1.49. Uh, it was just a good deal, and I like to have some gum in my purse. These Chex Mix bags were on sale, and I had a coupon. It made them $1.11. $1.11 per bag so I got two bags and the like Cheetos and Fritos were on sale for $1.99 I think like uh, Labor Day weekend sales we have decided that we're not buying potato chips anymore because like the amount you get in the bag is so disgusting honestly <laughs> just we just like no we're not wasting our money but um you know these Cheetos are they're pretty full cool. And it's, I like Cheetos sometimes. So I got two of those, $1.99 a piece. And I actually went in my local store today and got two bags of potatoes. They were on sale for 99 cents, limit two. So that is everything that I got today for $70. I thought this was gonna be a big stock up haul, but I just didn't really need anything. We still have milk. Um, I don't know, we have meat, we have some bread. I probably should have got a loaf of bread, but um, yeah, still still learning to uh, buy less because we're not eating as much as a family of three instead of four or five. So yeah, that is going to be it for this week. I hope you guys are having a great week. I'll tell you what, I am loving um, my grocery hauls being, uh, you know, smaller and less expensive. Maybe it'll help me like build up so I can do a larger one at some point, usually a big meat haul because meat is so expensive. So anyway, that's going to be it for, from me for today. I hope you guys have a great rest of your week and I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys.